Right, so what I'm going to show you is how to add floating point numbers. So we've got 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, plus 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, plus 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. Now, first of all, don't make the mistake of just adding these together. That doesn't work. What you've got to do is actually use your floating point and normalize. So you've got to normalize these. All right, so I'm going to normalize that. And what I should end up with is that's going to move 3, and it's positive. That's going to move 1. So I've got my exponent and my mantista. So if I work out the first one and have 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, the decimal place would start here and move three places, 1, 2, 3, which would give me 0, 1, 1, 0, point, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now the next one would start here and it moves one place because it's a positive one. So I will end up with 0, 1, point, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And what I'm going to do is pad it out. And now I'm going to add those together. So 0 plus 0 is 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, point, 1, 1, 1, 0. Now, remember what I said before, you don't add these together to get an exponent of 4. That's wrong. All right, what you've got to do is normalize your final number. If I was to take that back to where it needs to be and normalize it, I would end up with 0, point, one, 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 two, three, four, five. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Because the, I wanted the question in ten bits. But to get that normalized and to get that back there, that was one, two, three. So my exponent would actually be exponent would actually be zero, 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 one, one. Does that make sense? All right. So you don't add those together. All right, you work out this, you normalize it, then put your decimal place where it needs to be to normalize it, and then you've got your exponent. And that is how you add floating point numbers.